going to show you how to make a delicious and lightly spiced salmon and quinoa salad. Now I'm going to start by making a lovely zesty dressing. So I've got one lemon and then quite a fine grater. Just gently pair off the zest. Try not to get any pith. And then just set the lemon aside because we'll be using that later. And now for a little bit of cayenne pepper. You only need a little. And then just a dash of olive oil. And I'm just mixing it together with a pastry brush. And now here I've got a tray that I've lined with foil and just very lightly oiled it. And I've got two gorgeous organic salmon fillets and we're going to pop those onto the tray. And then we're just going to brush this seasoned oil over the top of the fish. And once you've got a good coating on them, we're going to pop them under the grill now for about six to eight minutes until they're cooked all the way through. Now the salmon's cooking away nicely, so it's time to make the salad. And in here I've got some cooked quinoa, and I really think it's a fantastic salad base. It's got that little bit of crunch. So that's all cooked and cooled. And to that, I'm going to add some diced avocado. I think it's a good idea to just lift out that little stalk. Hold your knife at the top and then roll the avocado against the knife until it meets the join. And then if it's perfectly ripe, it should just come apart easily. Now I think I'm just going to use half, so just scoop out the flesh using a spoon or remove the skin however you prefer. And then I'm going to go for quite rough dice. Slip those straight into the quinoa bowl. I've got some diced tomatoes, some sugar snap peas that I've been halved lengthways, and then some fennel that I've finely shredded. In that goes. Now, just for a little bit of simple dressing, I've got the lemon that I zested earlier. Just cut that in half and squeeze in the juice. And then use a fork to lift out any stray pips. And then we'll just add a little bit more olive oil. dash of grand allspice. Let's just pour that over the salad. And then to finish it all off, I've got some fresh mint and parsley here. And give them a rough chop. And then just scoop those on top of the salad and give it a little stir together. Now you can prepare this ahead of time and pop it into the fridge until you're ready to serve, but I think that my salmon's probably about ready now, so I'm going to put a little bit onto a plate. Really beautiful colours and lots of different textures in that salad. There we are. I'm just going to go and collect that salmon now. And the salmon looks beautiful. It's nicely browned and cooked all the way through. I'm just going to lift it carefully onto our plate. And there we are, salmon and quinoa salad. Mm -hmm.